It's that time of year, daylight saving time. We'll gain an extra hour of natural light in the evenings, but the downside? We will lose an hour of sleep, and that could have major consequences. Here are five ways springing forward can be bad for your health. Number five, fatigue at the workplace. Grab another round of coffee because you may experience a decrease in performance, concentration, and your memory could get a little foggy. Some psychologists suggest that sleep-deprived workers tend to spend more time cyber loafing, using the internet for entertainment and personal use while pretending to work. Number four, attack of the cluster headaches. For people who suffer from these rare headaches, the season change can be extremely painful. Cluster headaches often happen after increases in warmth and light. Some people report bouts of this rare disorder around daylight saving time or around the time of summer and winter solstices. Number three, a drop in in vitro fertilization success. The weeks following the time change may pose risks for women who have had a previous miscarriage and are undergoing in vitro fertilization. In a recent study, miscarriage rates were much higher for women whose embryo transfers were conducted within 21 days of the start of time change compared to those whose transfers were conducted the rest of the year. Number two, more traffic accidents. Everyone needs to really watch the road. When the clocks change, sleep cycles are interrupted and drivers can be more tired than they realize. Losing one hour of sleep takes an adjustment and motorists need to get more rest especially on Sunday after the time change. Some recommendations include traveling at times when you are normally awake, drive with an alert passenger, and grab a quick power nap if you can. And the number one and most serious risk of daylight saving time to your health is a heart attack or stroke. Disturbed sleep patterns can contribute to high blood pressure and poor mental health. Both are causes for a heart attack and strokes, especially in older adults and patients with cancer. A 2014 study published found a 25% jump in the number of heart attacks occurring the Monday after the clock change starts. The combined stress of a typical back to work Monday and that hour of lost sleep is particularly hard on people who are already vulnerable to heart problems. So the bottom line is, the closer you're able to stick to your normal routine, the faster your body will be able to adjust to the clock.